This truck has got so much pep. Like the minute I step on the gas, it flies. It, and then it reminds me of my truck, my Chevy. My Chevy. It's like when I hit the gas, like, oh, you want to go somewhere? <laughs> I thought I was parked. Three hours again. We have to go upstate. We got. Thought you were done going up there. Like, no, no. I live there. I go there all the time. Okay. So I just text Bobby to tell him that I know the distillery. Yeah. You can stop moving shit into the place. Touch it. Here's your stud finder. No tip. Broke off. You're gonna go to Home Depot? Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Yo. I guess we gotta go. <laughs> Watch your, watch your back, come on in. Now, okay, look at this watch. Scramble plate. Watch. No running board. Do you have your brakes on? I don't know how you did it. We've had the truck for a couple days now, so I need, you know, next time we go to Walmart, I'm going to get one of those little plastic steps. I'm going to step up on it, then I'm just going to have to leave the step in the street. No, put it on a string and you pull it up. <laughs> <laughs> I need an apple box. That's what I need, a disposable apple box. It could be like red solo cups. Red solo cup. You up. What are y'all doing this morning? Did you sleep in there last night after the party? Got to bed about one o'clock this morning. Did you know this was the tax house? This is where they handled all the tax information, apparently. Maybe they'll tell us that right now. Good morning. Hey, how are you, buddy? Doing all right. Uh, can I help you out? Are you doing the tour? Uh, no, the tour is over there. This is oh. a uh, private group. Oh, sorry. This is a little plug. I'm going to be doing a bandsaw demonstration of an axe handle at the Filson store May 12th. This coming May 12th. So if this is out before that, yeah. come take a look. May 12th. Could I have that? Mop and glow paint job. We got Shawnee on the trim. A couple extra hedges with this plastic fake shit that goes on top. It had that weird baby poop green color for the underpainting. We're gonna nail that shit to it. And lots of glue. And a lot of glue. You know, you can never be too careful. Instagraph. Ironically, it's it's made from really old dead plant products. You know, this is petroleum based. There's a pinch of irony somewhere in here. But. Out here. Boxwood hedges. We had to bang on three more to complete this design. It's sort of a pathway wall thing. There's gonna be a huge inbred horse that uh, is hidden via this wall. I mean purebred. Inbred? Pure, purebred. Purely inbred. Purely inbred horse. And it's gonna be behind here. But check this out. Now this is pretty deep, so put your helmets on. This was oil originally that was made from what it's trying to mimic right now. Millions of years ago, how cool is that? I thought so too. Uh, I guess 
It's okay. Get you flat my tires. I don't feel like working this month. This is Phil. How you doing? And the cat is Buster. I'm driving to Canada. I'm moving to Canada. And I'm gonna build my brother a house. Oh, that's cool, man. Yeah. He built this. He's got all of his tools in here. This thing is like a thousand pounds overloaded. He's got the cool cat in the truck headed to Canada. This one was completely shredded. And what the hell did he do? Did you just this, take this, this hang off and then go for a ride and find it? I had two spares. Fuck. So yeah, I, I had one spare on the way to Dallas. It blew. Then I was like, okay, well, here I am. I might as well get two more just in case. All right, now I have no spares. So I'm going to try to find some maybe in after I go to Woodford. And that's a Chevy, is that a 2500? Yeah. And how does it feel pulling this? Is it good? It, yeah. You're just doing it, the waddle all day long. It's like, <laughs> you had the wrong ball on. The thing bumped the back of the trailer. Nothing stops this guy. And this is his whole life, moving. He's just making it happen. You want to drive to California again? <laughs> Are you with really just there? <laughs> Bowroom, it's one of their featured products. They have all these little tasting spots, so here you see all the different tastings. This, I think, was called the tax room, you know, back in the day when this place wasn't rocking and rolling. Yeah. But you did all this. Dave made all, figured all this out. Dave actually carved these keys, five keys. The five keys is a thing called the five keys of distillation, and it's like the five processes. So that's what the symbolism is of the five keys. But Dave, you figured all this out. This is a tasting room. I don't think it's operating at the moment, only because no one's been in here. Did you do this? Nope. No, that's a pre-made door. And who made this? I, you. Oh, I made that. So they wanted this sign. A lot of people got uptight with me that I made this sign wrinkly. But some of the reference for this, this was remade. This is something that was here, but somebody stole it. They don't know where it went. This was made in the beginning of this distillery, whenever that was, the turn of the century. So this old sign was hanging here. And they asked me to sort of recreate it. So I left the wrinkles and stuff in it purposely so that it looked like the legit original one that went missing years and years ago. Pertina. Yeah, this again uh, was a whole gut deal. You know, they, they're just carving out the experience. Red Sent feather. You. Not a lot of <laughs> Who sent you? Her. Yep, green tomatoes. Yo, let's go. Yo, let's go. Watch your back, come on. Yo, let's go. 